Well, dang. It looks like they done fry buddy like bacon. Well, you know, Young Thug's brother, Um Funk, who actually got out of jail, you know what I'm talking about? Not got out of jail with no type of limitations on him. But of course, he was one of the people that got arrested, and they did actually release him and let him go under strict guidelines. You know what I'm talking about? He had the probation, he had rules he had to follow. But of course, you know what I'm talking about? He was deep in the streets, and when you deep in the streets like that, you know what I'm talking about? Sometimes you gotta take risks to go get the fatty, and that's exactly what he was doing because he was re arrested after they left. Let him out, you know, talking about with a 10 year probationary sentence that he could have served the 10 years in probation and been free to do whatever he wants to do. However, everybody knew the chances of these guys. They got caught up in this Rico case. They got like 10 years probation, 15 years probation, 20 years probation. Everybody was already saying it ain't no way in blue hell that they're going to be able to do all these years of probation and not get caught up, which everybody believed that this had to be some sort of trick that they were going to, you know, talking about first they had to accept the plea that they would actually take the stand on Young Thug just to be able to be free if they got called to the stand. And then they had to serve all this probationary time and anyways well it looks like young thug's brother of course i reported he got arrested but after he's been arrested now they finally gave him his sentence and we'll get right into that right after the intro welcome back to key talk media this your host key talk check it out man all right I'm going to get shots of the notification game. Keep talking game for rocking with me every single video. If you listen to my voice right now, go to hit the notification bell so you get a notification every single time I drop a video. Anyways. So it looks like on phone got nine years he got to serve inside of jail plus six months. Now, the reason they probably gave him the six months and not the 14 years like his probationary was, was because he actually already had served some jail time and then he was outside of the jail. So they probably counted both of those together and came up with nine years years and six months that he's gonna have to serve inside of prison but he because he cannot follow the rules of his probationary i'm talking about well it don't look like he'll be the only one you know breaking that rule because like i say they say birds of a feather flock together now of course you don't wish nobody else breaks it but according to statistics yeah, the statistics say that there will be multiple people that actually breaks it. Just like y'all, the people was thinking like, yeah, somebody's somebody's definitely going to re-get arrested and not, you know, somebody follow all the rules of that probation. Well, he happens to be the first one. Now, as it happens to anybody else, I will definitely let you know. But he's the first one to go to get re-arrested. He got caught with a gun, pretty much. You know, you got to have a gun if you're deep in the streets like he was to save for protection. But of course, you know, somebody, they're going to be trying to hunt you down. They Like, their goal... They want you to do something so they can rearrest you, right? Uh, so, you know, they give you this 10 years. They, in their head, they know the statistics. They know that more than likely you're going to do something else where you're going to be in trouble. And especially if you're in the streets where you got to protect yourself, you got to have a gun. So it's kind of like a lose lose situation. Anyways, well, this is just a short video. I'll let you know the young thugs, brother, on phone got nine months and six, well, you know, six months and nine years to have actually got to serve. Let me know something. Do y'all believe that he'll be the only one that they'll, they'll learn from him and he'll be the only one to get in trouble? Or do y'all believe there might be some more people that be looking at some more time getting rearrested? Let me know some. Coming down below, let me know what you think about this entire deal. I'm out.